shouldn't have come for me. Should have run. The world is weak. Soft. We have forgotten what it is to be strong. You know, our heroes used to be gods. And now our heroes are godless. Weak. Feeble. Diseased. We let the weak dictate to the powerful, and then we are shocked to find ourselves adrift. But history knows the value of sacrifice. Of culling the herd so that it stays strong. Over and over, the lives of the many have outweighed the lives of the few. This is how we survived, and we've forgotten. And now, Bill has come due. Now, the collapse is upon us. And this time, the lives of the few outweigh the lives of the many. And when a nation that's never known hunger or desperation descends into madness, we'll be ready. We will call the herd. to be done. You must be hungry. <laughs> yeah. Did you know it takes 10 days for civilization to collapse? Yeah. You take away a man's basic needs and he will revert to his primordial instincts in just 10 days. <laughs> That's a difficult thing to understand unless you've lived it. I was in Iraq during the first Gulf War. 82nd Airborne, all Americans. Hoorah! <laughs> One night there was a, an ambush. And me and this guy named Miller got separated from the unit. No food. No radio. Nearest base, 200 clicks to the south. So we just started walking. Well. Wow. By the third day, I knew we were lost. Day six, ran out of water. You know what that's like, don't you? Difficult to swallow. On the seventh day, Miller's legs started going all wonky. Did you know your brain starts to eat your muscles in order to survive? That's why you're so goddamn skinny. And by the eighth day, the wolves were closing in. And I looked at Miller and I could tell we were as good as dead. And I accepted that. And in that acceptance, came clarity. You see, I wasn't just looking at Miller. I was looking at an opportunity. And it wasn't something I wanted. It was something that I had to do. It was, it was my test. You see, Miller's sacrifice wasn't about me walking out of that desert. It was about bringing me here. The weak have their purpose. You'll understand that soon enough. Mm-hmm. 
be out of here soon enough. Did you think you were free? Well, you little buddy. Went to a whole lot of trouble for nothing. That's okay. He knows better now. I told you, you're not a hero. You are a tool. And you know your purpose. You've known it from the beginning. this coming I don't know if he talks to God that doesn't matter he was right humanity is once again in crisis it doesn't matter what we build or achieve we will always find a way <laughs> to break it down Babylon, Rome, empires rise, <laughs> empires fall, America, we're no different, we think we're indestructible, World War II, war on terror, we survived it, but it only brought us closer to the edge, and this is where we are, right here on schedule just waiting for someone to push us and oh boy if you pushed us <coughs> you did everything he said you would do 